Hi friends, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. I'm coming to you guys with a kind of, I'm pretty sure this is like a collective September haul. Let me um, just double check, not that it really matters, but I think like maybe one or two things came before September, but we could just call it that because like I, sometimes right now I have months where I order stuff and months where I'm like not spending as much so yeah so most of this should have been like August 31st so pretty much on September uh, pretty much September um, or it came in September or right around September so it wouldn't have been in the last haul so we'll just call it a collective September haul we have two new planners technically um, one's like a I just got because I started to use this planning method and I'll try to show you guys some of that in this haul like what I was using as like a personal just like decorative for me B6 from the honeybee shop um, I already had one that I had purchased at the beginning of this year to use and then I decided like in August I don't know what took over me I was like I miss planning with stickers but I sometimes I don't have the energy for like a full spread with the foil and all that because I don't use foil in the B6 so that's what I've been using and also using it as like lists and to do's and all that so We'll get into that, but um, I also have some Aura Stell, I have Caress Press, I have SBC, I have Paper Shire, and I think, and once more with Love, and I think that'll be it. There are two things that technically shipped, but I don't feel like waiting for them, so that'll just have to go in the next haul. It might be super small, I don't know, I'm trying to be better about budgeting, so that's that. All right, so first things first, we have this black B6 cover from the Honey Bee Shop. It is for my B6 planner. Um, you'll see I have like a uh, one for once my one I have currently runs out. I have this and I think like this pocket with the jelly is so cute and the little scalloped edges. Um, it's kind of like a TN thing also. But the thing is, um, unfortunately, my, I'll show you. Sorry, Cannoli. I'm backing up and he's in here. But the one that I have right now, I use a jelly cover on from the Honey Bee Shop. And unfortunately, um, this doesn't fit in there with this cover on. I wish it was made like, bigger for the jelly cover to fit. But um, essentially, this is like the cover. So this is my custom Paper Shire um, vanilla that I, not vanilla, a uh, Nana that I got. And it has cannoli and my planner and my Minnie Mouse ears. She doesn't do customs anymore. I mean, maybe like if you win her activity, like engagement in the Facebook group, you might be able to do it. Um, but this I did during um, Zinni was amazing and she did a Black Lives Matter like fundraiser. So if you paid money towards like a scholarship fund um, at the University of Kentucky that was set up for uh, Breonna Taylor, who unfortunately was uh, murdered by the police, um, kind of like, I'm not 100% sure, I don't want to speak um, with certainty, but I do think there was like some conspiracy around it. Um, definitely really sinister stuff if you look into it, so just do your research, but yeah, so that's where Zinni was doing these nanas, so I donated and I sent proof that I donated, and then she gave people custom nanas, so and also she's done it for her PR team, so we have this Fox and Pip pink and like pink holographic uh, glittery vinyl and then we have this uh, white and pink peppermint Mickey um, vinyl and then I use these Sony Clover CM sorry I just burped CM stickers I got from their Target sticker collection because that's what my initials so um okay so on this page I'm not gonna go too depth in this but I didn't put like my name I'm gonna put like maybe a vinyl I didn't write my name and then I have a little sticky pocket here from the Coffee Monsters Co. And this was September. September is officially over. Um, I probably should have added in. On this day we got our puppy cookie. Um, I had a nail appointment this day. I had a nail appointment that day. So I hadn't added those things in but I can do them retroactively. It doesn't really matter now. It's over. Um, this is looking ahead at October. Um, I marked like my fiance's dad's birthday, um, I have class, I don't have class this day, I have class this day, and then 
my best friend's birthday is on the 5th i'm seeing the eras tour uh, movie or doc or whatever um on the 13th at 10 p.m super late and then i mark my friend cindy's birthday and then my birthday and then halloween and paydays are marked as well so nothing like too crazy i do like some doodles and then showing you guys just really quick this was the first week and i wasn't like the bet like figured out what i wanted to do like i knew this one i forgot to even mark oh i did i marked the weather at the bottom i'm i, I prefer to mark it at the top now but um yeah it was my best friend's birthday one of my best friends and then i marked the weather and marked like i had lecture my fiance had lecture this day because he has to leave in the middle of the day so it's something i mark more um if he like went to class at night i don't think i'd mark it but he goes at like 12 30 because his class is at 1 30 um and then i had a endodontist consultation spoiler alert i had a root canal um we saw bottoms and um we dog sit uh, my mom's uh, neighbor's puppy and we went to a um new place to us that was like uh sausages and they had beer and like slushies and stuff um we also went to dinner with my fiance's friends and i had a nail appointment so there was that and then like this was how i was like doing it the first week i wasn't like super sure on how i wanted things so and some days like i just i was also using another planner with like pen i've mostly started to just kind of do everything all in this one so then we have this one this one looks like a lot better to me except i hate where i wrote in stuff um cindy if you follow obsessed with paper she does her so much better than me um but yeah this was this week and then i journaled on this day i don't journal like a lot she journals a lot more than i do i mostly use mine for like to-do lists and then like uh, you know writing down stuff that happened or whatnot if i have to but um so yeah and then this was the week i was like trying to be serious about working out and i need to get back to that this is one of the better weeks um so yeah we went to um an apple cider orchard and i had torchy's tacos i got my flu shot target starbucks pizza night um all the things so this one turned out better because i started to use like more stickers and whatnot but this is like me doing my to-do list and then this one I haven't really done. I'd like had stuff in pen, but I was like, I'm gonna just go back and like put the stickers and do it that way. So we have this. And then, oh, hold on one second. Cookie's in here. So yeah, some days, this was the week we had cookie. There was no to-do list. <laughs> we were just trying to get on a routine and survive. Um, this is the current week I'm living in. I need to go in and fill stuff out and um i did use at first um the honeybee shop has these like date uh no hour washi things but i decided to just start writing it in because i could make the to-do list longer because i think hers starts at seven and ends at nine um let me see it starts at six and ends at nine okay well i just started doing it and i could make it go till 10 uh because the thing didn't go till 10 so this is the current week and I've already started up setting up next week. Um, nothing too personal in here. So um, and I'm using this SPC, old SPC kit. So that is that planner. Just to give you guys a quick rundown. So that was that. And then, um, yeah, so that's why I got this. <laughs> Long story short. Um, then let's just finish up with the honeybee shop so with that order i also placed another order for one of these which is the planner um it's super fun i like that like you can be decorative but not have too much going on and then also have like the dailies and the hourly and whatnot view um i have also had been using um i'll show you guys i had been using for just like writing down stuff pen planning um the aura estelle planner um i had just been using pen and writing down everything that i needed to do um and using these stickers to mark the weather so that was with this planner but recently i 
well now I've started doing it in my notion but I started playing Jimmy Valley again so I started putting like what stalls I upgraded or needed to be upgraded and then like what biomes I needed next or which people and then I started marking like what are the favorites for the day for that person to level up their friendship and then I meant to do it this day I used some washi from the coffee monsters co I just ended up doing it that day writing it down um so there was that so I have been using that more for dreamlight valley so those are the two planners and then the other things were I got this payday little post-it to put in the b6 on the monthlies um or maybe just on the day of um then there were some freebies this was in like the go wild planner sale collab so there was the um one from honeybee shop this is from constance constanzi uh, i'm not sure um this is like beetlejuice and then we have um this little business card from shannon and she has just like she's a graphic designer stationery shop owner and then this is a holiday savings tracker um that came from debt free panda which i might check out some of my stuff because i'm trying to get my life together so there's that then let's since we're on the top oh there's also some vinyls i forgot about these so this is introverted uh but willing to talk about planners fueled by iced coffee and anxiety nope and then i had one of these on one of my planner and I wanted to get another one. Um, it says official planner babe club member and has a mild liner, a pencil, a pen, and a, like a glittery sparkly pen. So that was that. And then yeah so while we're on the topic of planners, a new planner I picked up recently and was unable to get was because of watching See Amy Draw and Fox and Pip. Cookie's crying. I don't know if you guys can hear that. It sucks because Cannoli wants to be in here, but he doesn't want the door closed. Um, so, give me get, give me one second. <laughs> okay, so this is the passport planner from Oristel and Annie Plants Printables. Well, I think Annie designs these, and Oristel does this part. Um, so we have this. This is cupcake and sprinkles. Super cute, and. Um, has like wallet parts and then this and um this uh through here oh, i thought that was see-through for a second we have the little scallops scallops back here we have these like day markers and then you can put a little charm down here which i did pick a charm to put down there that i have from fox and pip and then it came with a different color thing I'm not gonna switch the color I like this color and I like this texture it's almost like Saffiano so keeping that then I need to string this and I'm gonna have to google this because I mean not google YouTube this I don't know how to do that so that's this little planner I'm gonna be keeping in my purse like it's everyday carry <coughs> and write down all the lists all the things that need to be done all the notes so that was that part and then we have this bundle part also from Oristel and um so I ordered the inserts bundle and it comes with the daily um it has three monthly booklets and one grid booklet so a monthly booklet is one monthly spread and 31 daily spreads undated timed column five millimeters grid grid booklet I might go back and order another one because I think I definitely want to stick to this system um, I like that like so in the past I've tried to use like a pocket planner from Oristel and I like that this is already like I'm really liking like planners that are already kind of put together so I don't have to do much like printing and like maintenance and stuff like the most maintenance I have to do is like dating stuff and I can even use pen for that so not a huge deal um, but I love the neutral colors this one's like more of a beigey uh, pink just more beige kind of um it says monthly spread perfect fit index stickers include um so you have these pack of these index stickers and today's october 1st so i'm gonna be starting to use it today um and i just like that you can you know easily use this take it in and out and so then they have on this side they have your um 
hourly so six to ten and it's with two hours so six eight ten twelve etc and then on this side you can put your to-do list or journal or whatever so super excited to use this it's so small like this is it in the palm of my hand it's like smaller than my hand but it's so cute um and then we have this one here and then we have this one here and so then that means this one is the grid and i've tried to figure out like some accessories to order for this i know that they said like i had messaged cme draw because like hey i was inspired to buy this because of you but and i love your setup but how did you do it and so i, I looked on amazon for some things and some things are coming and also etsy um and then um some of these like feel oh is it printed on the wrong side i don't know i think it might be no i think it's right okay i was just expecting it to be a glossy but the glossy side's on the back that's confusing um but yeah so we have these i kind of wanted to use like some cute ones i don't know if i'll use these or if i will use these and then use washing and then start anew next year these are like i think like monthly things cover labels i'll have to see how oh cover labels okay so the cover label goes there and then i don't I'm not sure what to do with these um let me see here we go okay um i do like this layout of putting the weather i probably would track that and then track these things and um yeah i like that a lot and i'm not sure about what to do with those but yeah this is super cute i'm super excited i will try to show in the next haul like if i you know how i set it up and you know how i go about doing all the things so that was that oh nope one more thing i have oh i had actually got a freebie of this um strings so i think i'm good on strings for now but it came also with some of these like stickers that are the lineup of her um, products super cute and um then i ordered a basics companion grid notebook um the plus version because i had the smaller version and then she came out the plus version so it's a little bit thicker a lot more pages and i thought i could just like write down ideas or write down things in here i wish this one was pink covered like the other one but this has pink on the inside and then this tells you all the different things all the tom Rowe river paper collection that's what the paper is in this planner and i do agree it's like nice to write on um but yeah this is just a grid notebook that i wanted to write down stuff so so yeah that's that then since we're on the topic of planners i say let's keep it going with caress press because she released her planner and i picked that up um and we have some we'll keep uh, spc paper shire over here once more with love over here for now um so this is all caress press i'm pretty sure so first things first we have the dated month and weeks caress press 2024 a5 wide insert this is what i use for memory planning this I'm trying to keep it all together um i haven't decided which cover i'm going to use yet i think i'm going to do black black nails right now quite fitting um but yeah i mean it looks the same as it did last time i didn't even pay attention to like if she made any changes or anything i don't think she did but it looks the same as last time so i'm not gonna go too far into it um but yeah i i pretty much use this planner when i do plan with me so if you want to see how that like works you can watch my plan with these you can watch um plenty, plenty of people film with me um so yeah so there's that and then um we have quite a few things i need to open this one too um quite a few big orders from caress press <coughs> oh sorry i'm sneezing it's allergy season okay so oh, 
fell. Cool. Hopefully Noli doesn't mess with that. He usually doesn't. He's a, not a baby like his sister. He's still my baby, but he's not like into everything. Okay, so. Um, okay, so this is um, the witch's uh, bundle and it's hollow. Super cute. I'm gonna have it also in the, I think it's called like purple potion. It's sparkly purple. I don't know if you can see that. Um, I'm not going to open both. I'll just open the hollow one. I'm sure that'll be the easier one to see everything. So we have the hollow and we have this eight page of full box overlays and then we have three extra, a tall box overlay and the headers. You have the dates, the deco, hole reinforcers, bottom washi, and extra decorative headers icons and scripts and a weekend banner and then the bougie boxes which uh, they're just sparkly the normal sparkle ones um i'm sure you can't see them but yeah so we have that and we also have it in the purple version i have to figure out kits i need to figure out like the past kits before i can do all this then we have this booze and bats kit which i think i'm using for my birthday this year um my birthday is October 25th, so in 24 days. So we, I got this um, tall box, the medium skin brunette, and then we have um, the extra color sampler, and we have 15 millimeter washi, and this is the kit freebie with the nails and the hat, and then um, a couch scene. And then we have um, our deco, our square boxes, our flags, and our rounded labels and the weekend banner. And then we have the um, full boxes, super cute. I love these colors. We have our solid labels and headers. And then we have um, fancy label, like fancy pattern labels and some quarter rounded boxes. And then glitter headers. I, for, I don't really know what they call these. Um, little things, another extra box, heart checklist. Uh, Monday preview three habit trackers. I don't usually use these work labels. I usually don't use those either um, This is like a tracker either for like steps move budget whatever we have movie marquee we have icons We have little things heart checklists um, extra rounded labels uh, full box rounded labels and then these and then the bottom washi and an extra full this is the full box with a different skin tone and then a little thing up there which sometimes i forget about and then obviously it was date covers and uh the, the dates date dots so that was booze and bats let me know when you guys are going to be using some of these kits in the comments down below they're just super cute and i'm obsessed Especially this one, I'm like, I saw it and I was like, I want to use that for my birthday, I'm pretty sure. Then we have this Farmer's Market um, kit, which I guess I I have so many, like, kits for fall because it's my favorite time of the year. So it's hard to, like, use them all. Um, so we have this 15 millimeter plaid washi and then we have our deco, our square boxes, all that stuff since i already said it on the other one i'm not gonna like reiterate all the things this is super cute this kind of looks like this farmer's market i went to it wasn't really a farmer's market it went to like an apple orchard and they had a market it looks very similar so if this but i do have like an apple claim kit and it was apple-y so i don't know if i want to use this for that week or what um use this a different time use it in the b6 now i do have like guilt about using full kits in my b6 but that just kind of feel like means i need to use more stickers in the um daily but um this really does look like the vibes like when we went to that place so i don't know if i want to use this one and leave the one that i had planned because <laughs> it was something i didn't get to use last year so i was like i'll use it this year but then more cute stuff keeps coming out so we have this girl here with the tall box girl and we have this tall box here, extra boxes. Um, I'm so tempted to just use this one because it just really fits the colors, the aesthetic, the vibes. 
I don't know. I'll have to make that decision when I get there. That's also, I feel like, another reason, like, I'm not. <laughs> Besides all the thousands of things I have to do, it's, like, one of the things that keeps me from planning is, like, I have anxiety about stuff not matching, which is, like, dumb. Um, so, yeah. So then we have this one here. This is called Groovy Goals. And I also considered this one for my birthday as well, or maybe just hoarding it. Um, this is super cute. This medium skin brunette box. And then I got the extra color sampler. I like that Caress Press has been doing that. I got the washi with spiders. I, I have arachnophobia. So very brave of me to do that. And then we have deco, all the things. And this is so cute. Um, I almost feel like it looks more... It could be like, I like that it's like a mix. This reminds me of like kids' uh, birthday party, but this is so cute. Like, I wonder what the mood board for, for this was, and I love the colors. Um, once again, we're getting like all the pastels. Maybe I could use it for this week because my best friend is like, um, this coming week I'm in because my best friend, it's her birthday, and it's also my uh, fiance's dad's birthday, and. I mean, he is in his 70s, so <laughs> that could work. I could use this. I might use this for the week that I'm currently in. That way I can make sure I use it. Um, instead of hoarding it. Because I'm like, I'm sure another, like, Halloween birthday kit's going to come. And then I'm going to want to use that for my own birthday. So, uh, get in there. And then we have this life in plastic which i'm going to use like i'm not even like done with march in my planner so i'm using this for when i went and saw barbie in july um at first i didn't order like the kit i ordered the extras from spc but um so yeah i ordered the kit from caress press when she had her birthday sale so i was like that's fine to like mix and match so i got this girl even though i think i have a tall box version of her from spc with this like kind of chartreuse 15 millimeter washi but yeah this is what i'm using for the week i saw barbie in july um i saw it two times i saw it with my mom and my grandma and my fiance um i might use it for the first time i saw it i'll have to think about that my mom and my grandma were like i was so emotional about it and my mom and my grandma were like eh, it was okay and i was just like you guys are annoying <laughs> um my grandma's like, I think it was more for, like, people, like, your age. And I was like, Grandma. And then I, pff, these are the extra boxes. So I might not even need the SPC extras besides, like, the doodles that I got. So, I don't know. We'll see. We shall see. So put that on the back. So, yeah. We have that kit. And then, I like the cello for caress press it's just so much easier to slide in and out then we have this kit which i'm super excited for i'm gonna use this when i go like actual pumpkin apple picking um which is usually sometimes the week right before my birthday so um or maybe i could use this in november i don't know um so we got this uh fashion girl here i love her jeans I'm not team mom jeans, I'm team like flared jeans because I'm curvy and I don't think mom jeans look, would look good on me. Then we have this um, fall quote freebie, which I think I have in other colors, and then we have this one as well. And then we have the maple freebie with the sparkly orange and the silver, I mean gold, and this. And I'm pretty sure I have these uh, foil bundles, so that'll help to extend those. Then we got the extra boxes. We have some more extra boxes. Like, I was just in love with, like, all the options and the rustic colors of this. 15 millimeter washi. Um, these are, you know, these pages. And I just love the little dog. It's so cute. I want an Aussie Doodle next. <laughs> but probably going to have a Golden Retriever next, maybe. We'll see. Um, I kind of want a Bernie Doodle, Aussie Doodle, all those. I love the doodles. Um, if you guys... <laughs> didn't know or you don't watch my um instagram stories we got a puppy she's a mini golden noodle she is i think 10 weeks right now or turning 10 weeks this week and um i think we got her at, like in between eight weeks and nine weeks so this week she's probably in between nine weeks and ten weeks 
um, and her name is Cookie. She's a little princess, and um, yeah, she's my first girl dog since I was a baby. When I was a baby, my mom had a dog. Her name was Kenya, and my name is China. So my mom clearly has an affinity for country names. But she broke that. My mom got my puppy's sister. She was going to get her first, and we went with her, and we were like, when got <laughs> cookie well my mom got cupcake so my mom named cupcake cupcake because one i've always had a thing for like food names for dogs um and i you know she had suggested it first though she wanted to name it cupcake because of my character cupcake for my sticker shop um so i was like yeah okay sure my sister's my alter ego now <laughs> um so yeah so we got a puppy if you guys didn't know and so want all the dogs now but we need to try to focus on getting out of this apartment and getting our lives together um and finishing school so <laughs> really hard to have like on the spur of a moment just decided to get a puppy but she's worth it um we don't have any regrets so this is a monthly kit this is the house of haunt art and i think it came out last year um i just always pick up monthlies from Chris press because you know to have for the next year just in case i don't like the art especially if i like the art i just go for it so that was the monthly i got this tall box and this is like the extras so it's like the dates extra boxes deco so that was house of haunt monthly and then i think that was all one order and this is a different order um i can use this with the speak uh, if you guys didn't see this already use this with this groovy ghouls if you wanted to go hollow if you wanted to go black you could go mixed metal i think these are the only foils that it comes in this is like a sparkly black actually so super cute um so i have two of these one black one one sparkly black one hollow i'm gonna just open the hollow one to show y'all so we have our full box overlays more full box and a tall box overlay uh the headers this is so cute the bottom washi team uh the, the kind of decorative overlay the um what's it called whole reinforcers super cute deco day dots suit decorative headers scripts icons bushy boxes so that is the boo bundle and crest press is just killing the bundles right now like i am living for her bundles like i just can't so there was that let me move this over there move that out of the way okay and then we have this coffee town and this is a mini kit and this is for the um v6 planner that i use so i didn't get this for me to use in my main planner i got this for my mini my v6 that i showed you guys because i knew like i, I wanted to use this art but the likelihood not high uh, with how much kits I have um, so I got these this came with this this is extra boxes we have some deco some squared labels um, uh, heart checklist habit tracker these labels daily preview icons weekend we have the um, full boxes and then we have this page here and this page here letter headers and uh bottom washi an extra box a little thing date covers and uh, date dots so that's that kit and i usually don't buy mini kits so interested to see how this works because i've been using like leftovers for the b6 but i wanted to like start getting some mini kits to use like new art um this is the uh swifties 50s kit i am going to the Aeros tour next year um november 1st so almost one year away a year and a month away and these are the extra boxes i'm super excited my best friend got to go to the opening uh, date and i didn't get to go to any of the ones this year so i'm gonna be going to indiana to go with my soon to be <laughs> one day eventually sister-in-law just call her my sister-in-law for now and her sister um, they got to go to Tennessee and Nashville, so they went to that one this past year. So here's the deco. I love the colors. Just super cute. It's like very Lover Midnight's coded, um, which I love Lover Midnight's Reputation and Evermore. Those are like my favorites. And I guess 1989 too. It's also 1989 coded. Um, 
sorry to like debut in speak now and red <laughs> and folklore i mean i like folklore too i mean i like them all but those are like my favorites um so then we have these boxes and we have solid labels we have fancy labels we have glitter headers i'm not gonna keep saying all the things and then this is like the coveted i think sweatshirt that everybody wants um so then i got this fashion girl medium skin brunette um we do have floor seats that are like row 10 of like the main stage then we have these uh fashion girlies here um one of the sets taylor this so super excited i hope i have enough room with all these boxes to mark everything i probably should then we have these boo freebies which are so cute to extend the boo kit super cute and then we have these which are like deco little icons and then we have some scripts watch scary movies go to a haunted house halloween party pass out candy trick-or-treat happy halloween i think i will be home on halloween this year i don't know if kids will come i live in an apartment complex and when i was a kid and i lived in an apartment complex to go trick-or-treating we would mostly just um what we would mostly do is just go to another neighborhood like a house neighborhood rather than apartments so you don't have to keep going up and down the stairs and you could just um you could just you could just walk like straight instead of having to go up and down the stairs a lot of the time people like weren't home at apartments so so there's that and then we got two monthlies um i might use this for november this is pumpkin just like gives cozy thanksgiving vibes um then we have this uh, spread here, this here, and this here of all the labels and all the things. So that was that. Pumpkin, super cute. That's another cute name for like a dog, but I actually would prefer to name like an orange cat that. I'm sure there's plenty of orange cats named Pumpkin, but it goes with my like affinity for food names for her animals <laughs> then we have this monthly here which is the october lane i could use this for september i feel like i have some monthlies already here i have to look through all of my things so and figure that out figure that out we have this and this and that was everything from caress press was a caress press and then this is the last of the things here which is still a lot so um we will do all the spc together let's put that all together over there and then we'll do paper shire once more with love we can do paper shire once more with love last because like we're kind of doing like planners to kits um and foil to then like doodles and deco and stuff so this is the spc october 2023 mystery you can no longer purchase this i love the colors this is a good mystery for me um some of the mysteries this year have been really hit or miss for me but this one's a good one for me i love winter and you know just coziness so i also love these colors very cute i definitely do feel like some of these deco like some of these boxes have like a lot going on um i don't like the double box two double box scenes that's just making things more difficult so not a fan of that um and then we have stecco and this page here and then another double box scene like i think it's kind of overkill with the double box scenes um but these colors are really pretty super cute but yeah, I wish there was just like less double box scenes. Um, and then we have this full box. You can put a quote. And I like this ombre bottom washi and the like trees bottom washi. And then this extra color and the doodles. And then the fashion people are super cute. Um, 
I definitely feel like this artist, I think this is Coco's art house. I think like her best work is like not pop culture. Like I think she does so much better with like sets like this. Um, and then we have this, I think, I don't know if this is a new format. It might be new. Yeah, it is. Okay. So this is a new format floral bundle. I don't know if like she has extras of these yet, but this is like a matte silver snowflakes. So you have this. Maybe it's not new. I have to look back and see. We have the snow bottom washi. I mean, vision boxes, scripts, the icons, the new icons, and then the this. I think it's just like the snow version too, because I feel like I've I don't know used something like this. I can't recall. I'd have to go watch her new release video, but overall this is a pretty good like anytime kit for me. I don't usually like some of the anytime kits, but I, I, plan, I tend to plan seasonally. I don't use a lot of anytime kits, so that's my problem though. Um, so then we have an order here. I don't, oh yeah, she does include invoices, okay. I was about to say, I don't think she includes invoices, but I was wrong. Okay, so we have this quote box here in hollow. We have this rose gold deco, like, boxes, like, full boxes and deco and headers, the ghosties. I picked up this pinky, um, doodles of the week. Super cute. And then, um, we have it in gold, that same full box thing. And then we have this lavender hollow freebie. Um, from the bougie thing and then this uh, what's it called De what are they called these journaling cards um, it says thank you so much for your order and supporting our small business and it says signed Andrea um, I like the little Mickey on the back so we have that and these are the doodles I got the hazel um, this was it doesn't say which one it was oh it was number 87 so this is sheet 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8. Sorry you guys, my camera stopped recording. I didn't realize that, but I was just showing the doodles of the week. Um, I'm not going to go back. I probably missed like a few seconds, I hope. Um, I don't know where it cut off, but I think... I saw like it cut off when I was explaining the doodles so there's that and then we have another thing I think of colors of the week in this order or either some doodles we'll see yeah okay so we have these like charcoal black ones so I can show them in this one we have 13 Arby's will come in hand for my fiance so will Sonic Chipotle for me Taco Bell, we've been kind of getting into again. Ice cream, the workout set, um, the keys. I don't use any of these. I would never use any of these. I don't wish for them to be on this, but I understand why. <laughs> then we have um, 12, which is just like planners. I think this is like a paint strip card, like when you go to Home Depot to get the paint. A planner and coffee, planner, phone with SPC, um, a drill, brushes, washi, paint, blah blah blah. If you guys order doodles of the week, like, would you guys use these? I'm just curious. Like, I'm not trying to stir the pot. Like, I just don't play any games like that. Dungeons and Dragons. I don't use them. Like, uh, this is like a lunch. I would use the fork and knife. But yeah. Those are just my thoughts. I'm not trying to stir the pot. Just curious if people order doodles of the week, if you would use them. Like some things I'm like, I wouldn't use like this RV or this cruise ship. I wish like some of the stuff was like more generic. But I mean, I guess it will come in handy if you hold on to these and keep them in an organized way. Oh, I'm getting sleepy. I need some coffee. Ugh. And then I like the Disney ones. This would come in handy if you have any of the pop culture Halloween Disney. And then we have the Hazel. So super cute. And then we have a matte bronze uh, bougie freebie. And then 
we have this is another mystery yes this is another mystery this is from september 2023 and then we have these um <clears throat> confetti uh sparkly black and sparkly orange um foil bundles i'll show you the black one you guys might not be able to see the sparkles on camera unless i get like super close but this is the black bougie boxes icons scripts and here i'll try to show the washi it's not really coming up on camera it's hard to see i don't know if you guys can catch the shares but that is the black confetti i figured i could use it for some halloween spreads so that's why i picked that up and then we have september 2023 mystery and i do like this one this one's cute i could use it in like i guess spring maybe um it's just like diner diner cute i love the colors this is like some of my favorite colors like the turquoise and the pink the baby pink especially oh i just love the colors deco super cute i could see using this like i don't know where could where would you guys use this leave in the comments below these colors are so cute though and the, so are the patterns and i think this artist is dusk art designs or something like that we have the checkered bottom washi and the pink one then this yellow color not a huge fan of the yellow color but i do see like why it got pulled in and we have these fashion people and um <coughs> We have a twinkle hollow foil uh, bundle with confetti bougie and then this is an old format, scripts are old, all that. So that was September 2023 mystery. Let me know what you guys thought about the mysteries from SPC. Let me know what you guys thought about the kits, when you're going to use them. Give me your thoughts on the duos of the week. All that jazz. Oh, I also forgot something else but like it got hidden i have one more order from fox and pip but i have to find it so i'll come back after showing this to find it and show you guys like where did it go i have to find it it's somewhere on my desk okay oh i found one found this Where did it go? <laughs> I hate that. Okay, well, I will look for it shortly after, but first things first, one of them was this clear glitter acrylic ruler, and I have something else. So, but let's get into this once more with love first. This is paper shire, so maybe that. Um, yeah, okay, so once more with love. This is once more with love order, and it was my first once more with love order in a while. Um, Once More With Love came through with a big release, and I was so excited. Um, this is the journaling card. You are my moon and all my stars. So cute with the little doggy. And then um, we have, you know, this thank you note, um, a joke, Facebook group, all that. Then we have some washi, because I've been trying to get more into, like, the cutesy little washi for my planners. Um, so we have one with like planning stuff and this is like a planner desk one. So that is that washi. That was once more with love. Then this is a freebie item. It's an oops free item, not for sale. I don't know. It's like really thick. I don't know if that's why it's a freebie, but it's, uh, it's like kind of like scratched up, but I don't really care. I think it's like a washi card. It's super thick though. But it's so cute. There we go. So we have that. It's so thick. And then um, we have this Doodles freebie little icons. A small change up for August. Some happy doodles for you. I'm going to use all those. Especially my um, passport. And then we have this little one I ordered. I think I ordered this one. Where it says ugh with a coffee. Like a Radon type of mug. And then the um munchkin 
like tired. These are freebies. This is like uh, audio, all that I am, you and me. And then this one's cute. I'll probably put in my um, passport. Um, and it's just like a planner. And it has one spot with love stickers. So be kind. Something in your dreams. Um, love yourself to do buy stickers plan call home I think a pen washi the little munchkins super cute these are vinyls okay so then we have some icons and I need to go back and order some more icons because she released some more let me zoom y'all in so we have the trash to mark when I put trash out we have the laundry machine to mark doing laundry pencil for note taking or like homework laundry basket um, for laundry, once again, money, buying stuff, credit card, buying stuff for payday. I, I like that they're kiss cut and they're not circles. Um, this is a sleep mask. This is dishwashing. I wash dishes a lot with a grocery cart. Go grocery shopping. And the laptop. And the house. And shopping bag pot for cooking it's not staying focused car fork and knife and tv and there's some more that i want to go order so that's next later this month or next month maybe i'll wait for um the sale for like black friday i'm trying to be like black friday's coming so be still you know about shopping with stickers right now so we have this book lover i do love books i'm not great at reading books but there's that with the ghosties activity sampler i have the closure rings because i'm trying to be on top of that haha -ha, laughing munchkins pillow time i was running low on and then we have the library because i do go to the library when i want to just borrow a book we have the barbie so I can mark Barbie, we have the dentist appointment 3.0, and we have the doodle icons part one, and the doodle icons part two. So that was once more with love. And then let's get into this paper shire. And then I'll find the fox and pip, and that will be the end of everything. So this this is the cutest journaling card I've ever seen. A coffee menu. Oh, my battery wants to run low. Give me one second. Okay, guys. I just changed my camera battery. Um, Cannoli? Okay, he made it out. <laughs> he's trying to get out, and he's probably trying to bark. And I also found the extra thing that I need to show you guys. But anyways, this is the cutest journaling card ever. I kind of want to frame it and, like, put it at a coffee bar or something. I don't really have coffee bar that like that much anymore. I just have like my Nespresso with my cook syrups, but it's not really like a bar or anything. Like I don't have my tiered tray for it anymore. But this is just the cutest ever. Like I need a whole kit from Paper Shire themed after this. Just so cute. Okay, so here are the freebies. So this was during Paper Shire's Go Wild sale, I think. And we have this cute little journaling card. Cookie's barking. Because Cannoli has upset her. <sighs> I'm gonna try to keep going with it because I'm almost done. We have this here, the little um cute little stickers, and then the 20 pound orders, and um has like the little coffee machine, super cute. All of them are like coffee machines. I could use that for marking, making coffee, and then I could use this in my uh, B6 or my uh, passport planner. And then this is like a vanilla with coffee. I'm just, I'm here for the coffee theme. Love coffee. So we have that. And then we have doodles and kits for the B6 to show y'all. So first things first. Um, we'll go through the doodles, only that, so, ooh. okay, so we have these hair tools, we have manicure, because I usually go get my nails done, we have yummy Halloween doodles, we have autumn break time doodles, because I used a lot of these last year, we have the autumn laptops, the lazy day half boxes, medicine tracker, weather tracker, 
weather tracker again for um, I'm gonna probably do that in my I don't know I feel like I need her to make this as additional so I can have a lot of them um, I had first got them for the B6 maybe I'll just make some like clear weather icons for the passport we'll see um, we have these work doodle labels those are for the B6 they were for the B6 might mix it up we have the heat presses we have OMG making meals television planning layouts trying new things vinyl projects when I went to the beach with my family we did some vinyl projects I need to do some more and then we have weightlifting and then here we have some kits we have a soccer kit I'm gonna use this in the spring obviously around cherry blossom season and my b6 and then we have this caffeinated kit which I can use whenever I'm thinking like between now and um, you know right before it becomes spring so this caffeinated kit and then I have this pumpkin kit I'm gonna use this maybe not for this current week but the next week um, so this pumpkin kit we have winter cabin I will use this this coming winter obviously either between uh, December and January so we have winter cabin and then we have this candy cane kit use this around December obviously in the B6 so all of these are for my B6 if you guys are interested in like watching like a planner setup each week although it might be hard for me I'm like my desk is a mess it's hard for me to even film like everything's just kind of spread out everywhere so if I can get my life together I might do like a few but and you guys can see how I do that but we'll see because I try to do it more as like a pre-planner like the beginning of the week then have to go back and add stuff but anyways the last thing here is Fox and Pip you have this acrylic glitter <laughs> ruler and I already had one I don't I was using it I don't know I was using it for like keeping my place when I would plan I don't know where I put that so I ordered another one but this one I'm gonna use mostly for like B6 for like washi but then that, that was a plan but then I also saw she has this tiny ruler that I could use for washi for the B6 and the planner to like it's a washi cutter that's what I usually use for washi cutter instead of like an actual washi cutter so this one's um, a little tiny ruler super cute it's not glitter it's just clear and it has the pink bow and then <clears throat> She gave this cute little freebie and I've been liking her little new journaling style of doodles so I considered if she comes out with like some seasonal ones I might pick some up because I wanted to use like more journaly doodles in these than use um like decorative all the time like I wanted it to be more artistic I don't know but we'll have to see I might have to like buy some clip art make stuff myself because like there is a shop I really want to try I'll show them in case you're interested I also wanted to try some journaling stickers from like letters to Apollo like I'm not going to be journaling in this but I just thought it'd be cute like deco um the only thing is like if I order this shop like I'm gonna have to use these more towards like I can't get the spooky ones I'm gonna have to use them more towards like November and I like these are like kind of separated because I do get kind of like OCD about like stuff matching like I've become like a fixated on it but let me show you guys really quickly um these are like bullet journal stickers that I was considering using like in this I don't know how they're gonna fit we'd have to see I'd have to buy them and find out but um yeah this shop I was interested in getting some and I could definitely use these more like in November so I don't know but yeah this shop is called Artimation1104 on Etsy and their stuff is just super cute. I was showing my friend Cindy because she also does like journaling stuff. So yeah, that was everything for this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed watching despite all the interruptions and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Don't know when that's coming but make sure to like, comment, subscribe, turn on the bell for notifications to get notified every time I upload. 
Sorry that I'm laughing. Cannoli's doing his like happy dance. He just like ran in here. I don't know what he got into. Maybe he finally ate his apples I was feeding him. But anyways, that's it for this haul, guys. Sorry for the chaos. But I hope you enjoyed nonetheless. And I love you guys. And I'll talk to you guys in my next video. I love you guys. Bye!